Well, are these soldiers part of 10 of this Rom Total War Dart Mode 8.1 Cartaginian campaign with your host always called me 247. Um, I know that this is my most popular campaign. Thank you all for watching today. Uh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? We're gonna take Croton today and we're gonna advance on Tarentum and really, really handicap the uh, Brutii. Eye. After that, we're gonna continue our advance to Capua. Maybe not in this part, but we'll see how fast this goes, alright? Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is make sure that Julii doesn't do anything. So we'll block his part so he doesn't have any trades going on. Apparently, he's got some trades here. Um, I'm gonna move Ships this up ready. north to see. Aye, move it. No, he doesn't have any. That's a lie. Aye, we'll come back south. I will be changing my capital. Right now my capital is Carthage. And I will be changing that. I am taking Palma as my capital. It looks like a, a weird choice. But if you look on the map, it's in the middle of my empire. So, And this will help us a lot with Scalabus. So we'll set this at right here. They are happy. And you see the change here in Scalabus right away. Let's have a look at the town. So see 115 now. We're gonna be constructing sewers and a lot more stuff. Eventually everybody will be happy. Right now, cultural difference, unrest, distance from capital. We had 70% off on uh, distance to capital. Now it's only 35, it's a lot better. The culture penalty will come with replacing the building. So we'll do traders after that. We'll try to maybe demolish and rebuild the port. And I might demolish the walls and replace them also. So everything is Carthaginian there. And then we'll, we can actually advance. Uh, I thought about doing a small fight with you guys, but it's only three, four units. Uh, just wipe out those four so they don't go back and retrain. But we're not going to do that right now. Let's get into Croton. Because I have my militia force waiting here. Engage the enemy. That's right. Assault. Oh my god. This is going to be such a big fight. Crazy. <laughs> Let's do that on the battle map. Just so we can see Croton at the same time. And I don't care what he's going to do with his 3-4 units here. They are, by the way, damage unit. That's from the last battle. He came out with another army also tried to defend himself but that did not work here we go um, yeah it's not no need for a big speech when we're gonna kill uh, a bunch of guys here um, nope you are not holding my ram I'm sorry you are not we'll take those to hold my ram uh, <laughs> Same thing for you guys. Go this way. And we'll take my slingers to hold the ram. In my opinion, those are the worst two units that I have at the moment. That's why I'm using them. The rest are really good and I have to keep them alive. Alright. Um, I'm just gonna line up the ram. This one. Right here. And this one right here. Start a battle get into this gate open this wall he will not be using any of his towers oh so let's uh where are my elephants first no no protective formation here I'm not gonna wait for my elephants to come over and bash the wall, it's a bit long. Run it. But we are sending them in the center of this city. Go, go, go! We'll send them here. Ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -bum. Don't walk in my troops. They have no control. No, not this guy, he's got a banner. Ah! He's gonna stand up, don't worry, folks. <laughs> they don't actually kill your own troops, they just walk through it. Alright. 
Um, I might get the wall with the elephants. Since he's not using any of his towers. Get the wall. It's just extra, by the way. It's not needed. I prefer keeping my elephants here at the back. And Your soldiers and the battling ram are at the your soldiers and the battling <laughs> ram are at the gates. Yep. Now comes the test of their courage. We'll send one elephant. Send more than one. Yeah. Send two, three, four of them. Start moving. It, it, it takes a bit of a long time to get the walls down with elephants, by the way. This gate will be broken really soon. The wall also. Way before the elephants can do the work. Come on. Boa! 2%. 3, 4. It's still kinda... it's still not bad, but it's not really fast. We're done with the gate. The battering ram has done its work. Your soldiers have broken the enemy gate. It's time to see what the gladiators can do. Run it. Leave the ram. Come on. I should have advanced my gladiators a bit faster, but we'll look at Sam Knight and uh, Miramilo. Now the way to your victory is clear. I really like Miramilo. Let's let's turn around. Let's turn around and have a look at the troops a bit. Look at those freaking helmets. I love those. The Miramilo. enemy cannot hide. You have breached the walls. Well, don't don't stop. Don't stop, it's a great news. That's great news. Keep running. I'm gonna kill them with their own troops. That's what I'm gonna do. If he ever if he he just tries to move out, he's gonna be hit by javelins. Send another elephant. Well, almost done. I will destroy you. I'm just sending the gladiators. That's it. Alright, the wall is down. So he's got Vilitus and Slinger. That's not really gonna hurt. Run it. Yeah, I'm not sending anything else, sorry. I'm not gonna walk my elephants into that. I wanna just send them back in the woods. The wall is destroyed. Retreat, elephants. Alright. Attack! Come on. Throw your little javelins. Before I get you. Oh, he's gonna be taken by surprise. He will never have the time to throw any javelins. Smash! One of them actually just jumped. This is gonna be a real massacre. If I lose any gladiators on this, it's pure luck. How do you like how do you like that? Defeated by your own gladiators. Yeah, we just got the enemy general. He was here on the other side, by the way. He 
sacrificed himself rather than leading his men to a dignified defeat. Oh, you think you can just sling things at me like that? I lost one. Revenge! To hell with those. Let me pass through. We're gonna go kill the slingers. I lost two of them. That's not good. That's alright. He's wiped out now. Like throwing rocks at tanks. It's just that it, that stupid. Attack. Revenge. We lost two of our men. That's too much. Oh. The villagers are being massacred. The slingers are now engaged. That's it. We lost two guys. You know what? Just finish the villages. Finish them. One left. Slap him. He's dead? No. Finish him. Yeah. Let's run at the back. <laughs> Attack you. For Rome? That's what he said? Is that, that what he said? For Rome? No. For Carthage. For Baal and Milkart. Yeah. Get him. It's a nice, beautiful little fight. I like that. But, easy. I could have auto-resolved this pretty easily. But... Nope. It's better if I only lose two guys. <laughs> only one guy left. On him! He's dead. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You have clearly won the battle. Ah, two gladiators fell to this great battle, but that's alright, I think we'll have them back. I, th I probably got some great healers in this Carthaginian army. We'll see right there. I'm gonna Victory! occupy this. We have no, I do not enslave populace or exterminate populace, this is not what I do. If you keep them alive, if you keep them alive on the long run, it's actually better. You have more people in your cities. You can tax them more. They're not happy right now. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. I have enough money to repair the wall. I will repair the wall right now. And build a temple. What is Tanit going to give me? Improve farm production. Baal is good to keep people at peace. And we will be... This is a big city. So we'll be doing milk, uh, hold on, I'll be doing Baal, because it, it's a pretty short project, that's what I like about temples. So, let's have a look at our city here, get the taxes on low so people are happy. Would I be able to move my troops out? I can already recruit, let's do one unit for now, excellent, so that's done, this part here is done. Changing my capital was actually a really good thing. So, we can get on the move. Oh, hey you. We need more towers. You're gonna go here. Next turn, we'll... Oh, anything good here? <gasps> no, I thought they were elephants. I need more elephants. We have war elephants here that we need to move out. So eventually we have to pump out an extra boat. Oh, that's nice to see. Hello, my friend. Um, that's gold coming over it, probably to, probably to attack the, the, 
attack Spain. Get back in Cartago. Just in case. Just in case. So Scalabis people are a bit happy. I'll see if I can get some troops out. Right now I have those two units that I don't need. And I will disband them. Mighty general. I don't want to waste my money. Um, we have quite a good amount of militia right now that we can keep there. Let's just move just a bit out. out. Oh, that's beauty. That's a beauty. I'll go here. We need to reinforce this. I'm just going to keep that where it is. We need to reinforce this. Uh, I'm going to need more spearmen. More javelins, probably. Or more slingers. Um, I cannot recruit people at the moment. And we do have a barrack here. Oh, it's not big enough. We need to get it to 2,000. In you will notice that in dart mode, we cannot recruit peasants anymore. They're not part of the, the game anymore. Because they're only used... Honestly, they're only used to boost your, uh, your, uh, your cities. So, a good thing that those were removed. Uh... And peasants are not supposed to make a difference in your uh, in your armies or in your really in your in, let's say mi in the uh, militia or policing your city. Um, I think I will be sending part of this on the other side and then we'll attack. I'll send it here Move out. and then we'll see the results. Uh, I just want to see goal and what they're gonna do. Let me take a second to look at something. Diplomacy. We will look at. We have a lot of enemies, but that's all right. We're gonna look at the. At goal, they are allied with Spain. So they are most likely coming to my to Cartago right now. Well, with this, we should be able to defend. Um, let's skip the turn on this, folks, because I think I've moved pretty much everything. I don't... Oh, I have extra troops here and an extra boat. Ready to sail. Aye, my lord. Get in there. We will... I need a boat here so we can get that on the other side. The thing is, if I move this boat here, it's going to take two turns. Might as well keep the money, recruit one in the next turn, and then get some of my troops out. Especially the war elephants. So we'll have two units of war elephants walking on the barbarians. We're skipping the turn. What you saw real quick was one of my spy going uh, south to have a look at the uh, Numidians. See what they're doing and where they're moving. I'm gonna move Sire. this guy to Egypt. To obey. Moves depleted, sir. That's alright, he's got nothing. He's got nothing. So he's training all of his troops and sending them up north, probably fighting Egypt. I'll go here. Can we just like come here and put a tower? Move out! Yeah. Build tower. We can see our land. Um where are you going now, Mr. General? Not useful. Um where are you going? I think you're not gonna go anywhere. I think you will stay where you are. I kinda need something south here. Let's uh, let's move here. March. I hope he's not gonna attack me or break the alliance by doing that. Construction report. Oh yeah. You gotta love those long construction report. Let's look at Kiroton. So the temple is done. The first temple is done. Ooh, we have mines. We have mines. The taxes we can put to normal, but I will I'll keep them on low for a reason. I'll show you. So, two turns for this. After that, we're doing the mines, probably the farms to replace a lot of things, markets, sewers. So, just following our plan. That's done, Messina. Messina, what are you gonna do? Do the sewers now. Thingy, the temple of Milkart is done. I'm gonna get a bigger market here, I think. We have the mine plus one, the ports. Yep, we'll get a bigger market. 
Because I like stables, but I don't really want to recruit elephants here. Done. Sirita, the shipwright, is done. Um, I'm gonna have a bigger temple here, I think. Although the cavalry stable would be kind of useful if we get boats. Let's not forget our boat. 3 ram. The trireme is a bit bigger. So we'll get that. And we will build... Oh, what's that? Execution square. I think we should build that. But I'll do markets. Um, I think we're done. There's only one place now. Stepsis. Tepsis is a huge city. It's really big. Um, we will upgrade the temple before we do anything else. I'll build the shipwrights after that. So we can get more boats. And we will own the sea. That's the thing. That's, that's why so far there's no danger with the Romans. Because I own the sea. Ready to sail. What are you doing? Make ready for combat. Yeah, yeah, go away. I, great Lord, go the hell I, away. I keep blocking him. Yeah, a little pan flute. <laughs> I love this thing. Um, we'll prepare to get more militia. Do we have anything to retrain? Well, I might not retrain anything. I'm just gonna move up. So we don't have anybody to leave here. I'm gonna leave this those two units here. I don't need them. Just get out. You get inside. You get inside. Everybody is happy. Alright. I am on my way to Tarentum. Let's build rams. And maintain the siege. That's pretty good. I'm going on. That's my plan. So everything's fine. Uh, I will be recruiting a little bit more Iberian infantry here. So we can move some of them on the boat. I great lord. Might as well transfer yes, some Lord. units right now. Yes, the boat is not moving, you know. All You're going Sire. there. March. So, depleted, make Lord. sure that you follow with a militia force like I just did. You know, I had 3-4 units waiting behind to take the city and polish it. Or, you know, and be part of the militia. Make sure you have that. See how fast this is? Now we're going to the next. We're gonna have units training here. And then we'll do the same thing. We'll be sending it. We'll have three, four units coming here. We'll send them in Tarentum. And then we're going to keep advancing right away. Unless we need to retrain. Which I don't think... Oh, we really lost to Sam Knight. Oh, well. I didn't lose any Mermelos. Hehe. <laughs> All right. So what we're going to do is we'll take, a, we'll take a break here on this part. And you guys make sure to come back for part 11 that will be uploaded soon. Uh, thank you all, by the way, for following this campaign. This is, like I said before, my most uh, popular campaign at the moment. Played on the Dart Mode 8.1 for Rome Total War. If you guys are interested in the Dart Modes, you know, uh, maybe have a look at the Total War podcast. Uh, here on YouTube, I am part of this podcast with my great friend uh, Marcus or Mr. Mate 111. Uh, we have an interview coming up in the next hours with Dart. I'll call him Dart Vader, you know, Dart Vader himself, the great motor that apparently stopped moding. So uh, we will be inter interviewing him for a couple minutes about that, and that will be part of our next uh, podcast. So if you guys need the link for the podcast, uh, look in the description. I'll put it there. All right. Thank you all again for watching. Don't forget your thumbs up and your comments down below. And have a good one, soldiers.